Okay, what's good, guys? We can stream now. Find out. Getting the stream set up here. So we beat the game. Um, now we're going to be making some PvP builds. Game set up here. What's good, Plop? We tried to stream earlier today and it didn't work. So we're back at it now. Um, I know it's a little bit later than normal, but. Yeah, so we're going to be doing a setting up a build. Kind of have a map laid out kind of where I want to go. I want to document it. So I'm going to be doing a video on this. In the end here. So anybody watching this later, uh, we went with a bandit. It's the best overall to get the most stats for a bleed build. So first off, we're going to focus on getting the Reduvian Dagger and stuff like that. So yeah, we made a new character. Um, we're getting set up for PvP. This is legit. Like, I've researched some of some of the stuff that I want to do. Um, I just beat the game on, on my main account. Nobody's going to be a high-level PvP yet, so I'm going to make a mid-level character. Um, we're going to get the Rivers of Blood Katana, I think. Um... But yeah, that's kind of what we're going to do. This is like legit. I'm just starting. I wanted to document this with you guys. So you guys could see it and kind of know what to expect. It'll take, it takes a little bit to make up a new character. Because you not only have to be like a little bit better than the average person. Because I'm going to be like max level 50. And I'm going to have to go through the whole entire map pretty much. I don't necessarily have to kill everything. But that's just the idea. So if you check out my video that I did going through all of the like the golden seed locations especially in the early game um then this is what i'm going to be doing the beginning route but i'm going to expand on it more i'm going to do a very in-depth video on this because this is um some very important very important stuff for pvp like the i enjoyed the boss fights but um my overall enjoyment is in pvp not not bosses so i gotta set up for this and I'm going to do a... It's probably going to take a few tries overall to like get like a perfect like setup. But this is going to be more of a scuffed one, honestly. Because I, I don't know exactly where everything's at. You know, this game's like a week old, so... Still trying to learn everything. Yeah, we I beat the game. Um, I beat it off stream. It, was, <laughs> it, it, it didn't want to work for me. No, I'm not going to do New Game Plus. I'm going to get into PvP. I'm getting a little bit antsy. I want to do some PvP stuff. So for this build, we're going to go with a... Um, we're going with a, uh, a bandit. Later on, I'll probably end up doing a um, like actual... To the foot. Um, summon me. Ah, I bequeath... Like, it will watching the story, but I'm really not paying attention to it right now. You can do quite a bit of stuff early game, man. Quite a bit of stuff. Like, we can go up past Godric and all those guys, and we can get pretty pretty well equipped and get some good gear and good up upgrades on our weapons and whatnot. Relatively early. Um, what do I think about level 50-ish level for PvP? I think that's where it's going to be the main stuff for now. The main, the main stuff. The only thing I don't remember or don't recall of 
is um like where I can get some decent summons so I can make the bosses easier on myself. Only to have that you know is quite a when you make a new character, you can transfer items from... No, 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 you cannot. It was a good phantom. Can I attack? Please. It was a pleasure to see you. Oh, tell them I'm fine again. Alright, there we go. Finally, jeez. These wolves are relentless. Fast time. So what we're going to be doing is getting our golden seed upgrades right now. Going to get some weapons as well. This takes a little bit to set up a PvP build, honestly. Because what you what you do is you have to you have to end up being better than an average player because you have to beat stuff at a lower level. What's good, Zach? So how you doing, buddy? Let me ask. Are you here? Does your despite takes me penny in all I know? Now's the time. Right, so there's that. So we'll go up. We'll get that map real fast. So we're gonna we unlock that shrine because we're gonna go get uh, Uji Katana. Bit. I think we're gonna use that for some of the boss fights at the early game. Maybe we actually may just focus on the Reduvia. Actually. So if you guys are just popping in the stream, we're making a PvP build, and uh, we went with a bandit. Oh, we're going to go focus on a bleed build. I think bleed is king in the early game. Think uh, Malik's... Black Blade? We gotta get something better than this little freaking dagger. That went the wrong way. I should follow my own guide. That may help some. So we're going to be focusing on our cane on this on this class, um, mainly for the bleed proccing. Um, we're going to get that up to level twenty. Well, the moon veil I've not really used it much, but I know it's pretty good. The moon veil is is fine. The Uji Katana just. I think the Moon Veil, you can't change the weapon arts, I'm not 100%. But the Uchi Katana, you can, so you can adjust it around. I've not actually come up here and talked to this guy before. I want to talk to this guy. Hello? Is anybody there? Someone who might be interested in rescuing the great Kenneth Height. Servant to the true I'm actually talk to this guy. Ah, you well, that's so. Despite appearances, might have untarnished. I want you to the night come. What are you, my fool? Oh, I fret not. Celeb I would that to pray honestly. God. First, then he in and to think me. What are you waiting for? Right now, we're focusing on getting golden seed upgrades and flask upgrades.
Shrink Faith build? Shrink Faith is pretty good. Um, I think right now, though, like, I I really enjoyed my, um, my playthrough with, uh, the Bloodhound, the Bloodhound Bleed, Bloodhound Fang. That was my favorite. I love this game. This game is a lot of fun. I think it'll have a lot of potential PvP-wise as well. I like it, personally. Never got that map, did I? Like a big dummy. I know there's one up here somewhere. May just have a nuke spell? I've seen that before. Or talisman. I hear you. How <laughs> do I get up there? Oh, I'm going to climb. Where the heck is he? Oh, that's a wolf. Or oh, that's a bear. Oh, there was a bear right there. down here. The heck is he? Axe town. You know where this uh, this wolf guy is? Am I blind or something? It's up there. Get up there. What can I do? Right, just. Hey! Down there, sir. get the freaking guy to come down here and help me out if I gotta knock down his tower or something <laughs> mm. it does it does mean it in the early game it act clash choice does make a difference How to get this guy down here? How to 
trying to get this guy down. Does anybody know? The wolf guy way up there. Oh well. Look it up. Going down here. Killing the bloodhound. Where's the the merchant kale? Limgrave. Oh, wow, he's all the way back there. Get this golden seed real fast. Okay. Yeah, it's all about the min maxing. Yeah, I was looking it up, but uh, thanks, uh, Patriot. Appreciate that. I'm looking for that talisman for that katana blade for later in the game. We'll come back here and this soon a second. This way, tarnished. May I have a word? I am the witch. I'd heard tell, and upon look at talk, thou art possessed to call for. I was entrusted by Torrent's form. Tis a bell for summon them with it. The spirits will obey. Now it is thine. Forgive mine intrude. I doubt we shall again meet. How long will it be for the tarnished tire of a base? Any? Wait. Well, you're back. I suppose he must still be scum. I know. Next time you hear the wolves howl, oh, don't fret. I just have. These waypoints make me think that they're like, like way shrines, kind of. But I forget that I could just fast travel when I press my map button. Oh, I'm not in combat. Grab this thing. Right. Go back there. So after we get this beginning stuff out of the way, we will go to we're gonna get the Reduvia dagger. Probably focus on Arcane early on and just stay with it. I think that's the best bet. Well, I will say, uh, Chocobo, that the, the PvE in this game is a lot of fun. But I don't want to just PvE. You know.
How's it looking versus ESO? Come. Hmm. Maybe the name's Blythe. I'm looking for a man who goes by Darrowell. He fled somewhere nearby. Come tell me if you find him before I can offer you ample reward. Darrowell is nothing but and in need of a fitting end. Dar and in need of a Armor is mainly just for looks, to be honest. Now let's go down here. We'll focus on. Actually, let's we can mix that phys physique flask, but we'll just keep going down here. Travel. So PvP in this game, it, it's a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. I had some fun when I did it last. And now I'm making a low-level specific build for PvP now. So, this is legit specific for PvP to PvP in the early game. But also the other few key aspects about PvP and whatnot is like, you have to be careful for like how high you upgrade your weapons or what upgrades weapons you find. Like there's a spear I remember that I found that was like plus seven. And um and I think that could have messed up with my playthrough if I could actually get that thing again. I, I noticed that too some, but I found one. There was a little there was a little um hold. There was a little rapier um in, in down down south in the uh the one area, I forget what it's called. Off my head right now. Right up here. Maybe it's one up here. What's going on, Shook? How you doing, buddy? I think the best PvP builds are going to be a bleed type of build. Hello? Might I bend your ear for a moment? My name is the Servant's Day. I, but I swear my good father decided him. I, the Servants are they've since come. I fear it's least. Would you mind my soul, please? We're just getting one set up right now. Deliver it to me. Um, there's three down here. Back. The heck, dude. I'm getting tired of my internet doing that, dude. Is it still here? I hope so. Hopefully we're here. Are we still here? Sorry about that, guys. Man, that's really irritating me. Do that for like a week, and then it, now it does it again. Now oh, it's... <sighs> just so irritating it doesn't have any issues at all for like the whole week whole week yeah the the weapon we're going to be getting the reduvia dagger and then also the the blood katana thing both have arcane scaling Do 
could wait till night time. Seems to be going stable now. Go. You won't be too far behind, dude. There's literally people still starting today. Yeah, I know you can respect Simba, but I'm saying like if you want to optimize your stuff and whatnot. Then starting off with a with a preferred build and class is ideal. Yeah, frost damage is good as well. No, it's, it's something else. It's called... It's a katana that shoots out blood. Um, in front of you. Pretty much is how it works. It shoots out blood. Yeah, that, that would be the Ash of War. This is a specific weapon that has this. The issue with the, the Blood Katana right now is it's best the earliest you can use it. The reason being is it doesn't scale. It doesn't scale off strength and dex like it should. So that thing is going to scale the most with Arcane right now. Once it gets fixed and it works correctly, then I think it'll be it'll be even better. Possibly. But as for right now, it's kind of kind of frustrating. I was looking at it yesterday because I tried it on that on that boss. That was one of the hardest bosses you'll ever fight is is um is the Molina. She's a freak she's freaking crazy. She has so much damage. Like, it took me a few times, like, five or six times to kill the last boss, but it took me over, like, 50, I want to say, 50 or 60 tries to kill Molina. It was one of the hardest bosses. Um, but in here, in this, in these ruins right here, if you ever wanted to do a, a, uh, faith build, like, a relatively early game faith build, there's a good scythe in there that if you hit them with your weapon art, it actually stops them from being able to heal. You guys didn't know that. The weapon art that is good that that weapon art that 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 scythe has stops the enemy from healing like so like in pvp wise um it literally stops them from healing it's freaking busted if you hit them with the second slash i do believe all right so we're gonna have like a plus three i think heals plus three heals wondrous Blast, we're gonna go healing and then charge attacks. I haven't finished the game, I think I'm gonna go ahead and stop and switch to my other character, Magic is 2 OP. Honestly, dude, you're you don't learn so I, I think Magicka is one of the worst starting. Like, okay, hear me out. You don't learn the mechanics of the game when you sit back and just like poke people. Most of the time in PvP, you, you're going to be getting pressured. And having that, having the pressure always on you in PvE, like getting focused by bosses and stuff like that. Um, I think that'll teach you more overall. That's why I focus on the boring old, uh, 
boring strength dex build at the very beginning. Now, Magicka is better for PvE, for sure. But I literally tried that Night and Flame sword, and there was nothing. Like, I didn't like it. It was trash. I didn't like it. All right, let's go back. So we got... All these. So we can get some... Let's go kill that one guy. Maybe we should get the Uji Katana first. I would like to have some something better than this little knife. Let's get the the Uji Katana comes from like a ruins. I think it's up here somewhere. I'm trying to find this uh, active map. There we go. Weapons. Kind of come here. Actually, no, I don't even know what I'm talking about, guys. Let's go get my Reduvia. Let's go get the Reduvia dagger. So we're making a, since you just hopped in the stream, nice. We're making a PvP build uh, for level 50. Um, I would suggest whatever your experience is and what weapons you want to use. I'm focusing on arcane bleed builds right now. So I'm, I'm focusing on that. And so I went with a bandit. Um, it's probably one of the worst starting, <laughs> except for wretch starting characters because the weapon's dookie at least with the wretch you got like a mace but this thing this this little knife is trash I'm saying i'm gonna kill nothing it has no range but i'm going for level 50. so i decided today i think the pve is fun and i enjoy it but after beating the game it feels like the only, the only thing I liked about it, like, was was the unknown. But like, once you once you kind of know what it is, is like, that's it, right? You know what I'm saying? So, oh, I can't even. Dan, it does have a bow. It does. But gotta kill this freaking guy. me at a homie want to show up jeez is my dude gonna come over here and help me Banded, 
because it's best in slot for what we're doing for our build that we're making yeah we're getting the Braduvia dagger for boss fights mainly we're making a build that's going to scale off of arcane Of the best, this is gonna be the best build that we can do for for uh, for our our playstyle at level fifty. All right, let's go towards. Let's get some upgraded stuff. Uh, well, typically a. At this level, we're going to focus on health. Am I going to dual wield Reduvia? No. We're going to focus on... We're going to get the, the blood katana. We're trying to remember where the first somber smithing stone upgrades are. I know these are the regular smithing stones. We can do shield and lance. That could work. Where's the first somber smithing stone upgrades? Cause I'm gonna need to find that. I know this is the regular old upgrades, right? Like this is the the chillin upgrades, the regular smithing stones. I just don't remember where the somber ones are off the top of my head. So we're going to focus on health. Um, mainly is what we're going to focus on. I know it sounds weird, but... You want to really focus on health whenever you're first starting out. In PvP, that is. And we're going to kill very few bosses. What level am I? We just started. This is a fresh playthrough of getting set up for PvP. Fresh, fresh. Uh, yes, this is my um, second time going through. Well, I played a few characters, but this is more of my optimal runs. I, I kind I've beat the game already, and I kind of know what I want to do um, with my with my thing, the character. Where's these somber stones at? I don't know where those are. I need to get this thing upgraded a little bit. Ah, remember this. That. Why don't 
didn't you just rebirth and choose the build you wanted, then start a new game plus? What do you mean rebirth? Like, so I'm already like level 100 in something. 130. So is there something else that I don't know about? Because I can respect my character and use those weapons, but the issue is, is I want to optimize my build for a certain level. That's how PvP works in this game. You're really optimizing your build for uh, like a certain certain level. All right, so let's go to the Dragon Ruins. Let's go get uh, the the seal thing, the red the red scar seal or whatever it's called. Where's Melina? At? You don't even want to. <laughs> you ain't touching Melina, dude. She's rough. Yeah, so... I'm not gonna focus on... There's not gonna be many people in New Game Plus. Anyways. For PvP-wise. You can PvP at high level, but the issue is, is there's not gonna be a lot of people there right now. It's just because the game's a week old. Nobody's going to... Not a whole lot of people are going to be focusing on PvP at... There's not going to be a whole bunch of people. You're going to find more invasions at, at mid-tier levels, like 50, 60, and 70. So this is just going to be from my boss fights, really. Um, using this for Duvia. I'm going to get... I'm going to get... Eventually go get the um, Rivers of Blood katana. What? Really? stealth. Please isn't he should have seen me. What's up? So I'm gonna just like I, I don't know if I said it, but I'm just gonna use the Reduvia dagger. Oh that's nice. Just spawn me here. I was gonna have to go all the way back. What the frick? Yeah. So, so what you have to do is you have to beat the game pretty much. So, um, you have to kind of beat beating the game to be more optimal with your level placement. So, like, the reason the reason why people make a PvP build is because most of the time, they're at least better players, right? I mean, that's just the reality of the situation because in order to make a strict PvP build, you have to be more competent of a player because you have to kill harder things at lower levels. But on your first playthrough and when you're first starting out and trying to learn stuff, it's best to just level up accordingly. And then once you kind of know what weapon you want to use and what things are going to be strong, then, um, then that's where you kind of can adjust things then. Like right now, I've already kind of have a decent map knowledge of kind of where I'm going. So um, I can decide. I kind of know where I'm going and what I'm doing and what I want to do for my character. And what I need to optimize. Where's this map at? There it is. Yeah, I didn't want to do a new game plus. I didn't want, like, once you do new game plus, it's just the same thing, but just harder. That's all it is. Just the same thing you just did, but you're starting off with your your um, first beginning with well, your character that you have.
Enemies don't get more health. It's easier, really. I thought they would get more health. They don't? What? That's gotta be dumb. Do, do they do more damage? Or no? If they don't do, no, do more damage, then that's gonna suck too. That dragon go somewhere? Oh, thank you. No, you can't optimize by respecking. No. The reason that is is for every character you make, there's starting starting stats that you that you start off with. So for the bandit, you start off with 14 arcane, 8 faith, 9 intelligence, 13 dexterity, 9 strength, 10 endurance, 11 mind, and it's actually I think 10 and 10 health. So you're going to go back to your base attributes. So if you start off with a vagabond, you're going to start off with more HP but less in probably arcane. So you have to adjust your mainly what you, what you do is look up there's a build editor that's a an amazing an amazing uh tool that you have so you basically it's it just look up elden ring build editor and it's called something like it's something like monkey or something like that so it's a, it's an amazing tool because you can optimize what you want to focus on um so for example some of the some of the weapons that I've noticed now this could be wrong and I I want to want to say that but some of the weapons like the Reduvia dagger like the the bloody katana these weapons f scale off of arcane what that means is, is is my stats are irrelevant like my strength and, and and dexterity forgive me I've been testing you to determine if you had it seems torrent whereas i may there is but i can take gathering place Fair. let my hand so like the reduvia dagger and since we're focusing focusing on arcane it's going to be the easiest to kill bosses and whatnot but this is a this is the initial beginning aspects of, of making a build in the first place like I was saying, like the this this weapon here, this Reduvia dagger. You see here on the bottom right, it says attributes required five, strength thirteen, dexterity thirteen, arcane. This weapon, I believe, scales off of dex, but the the katana, the the weapon art that you do, doesn't scale off of dex right now the way it is. And that's a big issue. Um, let's see here. Um no matter lay out you but nothing special I need to get, where's somber smithing stones at? Where's the plus ones? Does anybody know where those are? I don't know where those are, off the top of my head. Alright. Get to go back over there. to go up and through I'm going to the fort up here somewhere Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I, 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 I was using it, David, but I, tur I, I, I turned it off for now. Um, yeah, I'll look it up. I'll look it up here in a second. Cause I need to find out where those are at. So I gotta upgrade this weapon pretty, pretty quickly. Looking for something here. I don't remember being here before. I 
Well, no, I do. A strap don't fret. Should you excite, I will teach you. I need your her name resting at the church. The rotting when the earth but millis for this seek the, the needle. First, it's hidden, then I will the secret. First, it's hidden, then I the secret. Rune drops are increased. Let me pull up the map. Fort, and the fort is up above. Not here. We get to. Hmm. Oh, can we? we? Need to get up there. Anyways, supposed to be a one in the back and there's the church of plague, be a church. Here. Hey, no, it looks like it's up there too. All right, we'll come back over here and get this later. Let's go. Thanks for this. Thanks for the dollar donation. Uh, appreciate that. The pole blade. It's the same thing with uh, the bloody katana, isn't it? For how we can get over there. You guys remember? Know if we can. I think we have to teleport up to the Bestial Sanctum up all the way up here. Or we can do that. And I don't remember how to get up there. Alright, let's focus on... We have those two... Those want to go up here to this fort and get... Maybe we can try it. Let's see. I don't remember. I'll try think we can I don't think so let's see let's go over to hmm let's go kill him kill that back weapon is First, Bloodhound guy. And then we can actually we can go. I know where we can go. I know where we where we go after this. Not there. That was nice. Oh, getting sniped. We're gonna go around the city and then skip, skip the first few, first boss or two. We're gonna skip Godric and all those guys. I know what the graphic great sort of. No, I don't. Hey, Chocobo. Have a good night, dude. Oh, there's a sign of grace over here somewhere.
this is one of the best weapons in the game. If you guys are making a strength dex build early game, this is the best weapon in my opinion. Bloodhound. You can infuse this thing. It's so good for early game. So, so good for early game. Ready, Darn. believe? Rotting in a cell is no true justice. No. This is where it ends for you. I'm going over here like a sork, dude. Just, just <laughs> give him a nice little DPS run. I've not used the seppuku yet. I've not used that. All right, so that was easy. Um. Well, here's what we could do. Let's go get the let's get the Uchi Katana first. Let's get that. For here. That'll be a decent weapon to upgrade. The Death Touch Catacomb. I don't remember where that's at exactly. Because if we can get this to like plus two, this will make it probably be better than Reduvia. So we can kill some stuff over here and then have a little bit easier of a time. Death Touch Catacomb. I think they're over this way. This way. Stay good. Maybe. You know, every time Bloodlust procs, it takes longer to proc the next one? I did not know that. I think we go down. No, maybe not. Let's go over here first and grab this thing anyways. Eh. On it first. I guess right here. Important question, you play Fortnite or Roblox? Neither. Like early game, you can have seven healing flasks already. Alright. It'd be fun. are gonna take way too long to kill. Of 
Got to put my summons on too. Let's try to kill this boss, see if we can. There's a few farming methods right now that are pretty crazy. Um, and once you get like a new game, new game, you get a lot more uh, stuff. I've seen a few videos pop up on my feed about it. I've not, I've not really cared too much to do it at all, to be honest. I need more dex and strength here to do. Tell me you're gonna keep doing that. Is my bleed gonna proc on this guy? Your health a little bit. We'll be able to actually see. You see this arc? You see the passive effect? It says 51. I'll show you guys. See it causes bloodlust buildup. 51. On the bottom. Get leveled up. Now it's gonna go. I think it should go up to 52. 51. It didn't go up at all. Interesting. The, the blood blade will, I know. No. The katana does. Okay. I know for 100% the blood blade does. Maybe this one doesn't, isn't bugged. Um, so let's go up here, go get this PvP thing, and then let's go around. Bosses do not scale with level. They are ruthless whatever level you're at. 
I, I know for 100% certainty that the arcane increases the katana's blood bleed buildup. 100%. 100,000%. I know it does. So I might look at the Reduvia that's not an arcane build and tell me what your what your scaling is. Because I have 13 or I have like 14 arcane I think on this build. This is Elden Ring Eason. Let's grab this thing up here. Let's see if we can kill this guy first. On hyper armor there, sir. What? <laughs> okay. Okay, so then then this one may not do that, but I know that the 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 rivers of blood blade will. I know the rivers of blade does that. Okay. Got that, so we can go over here. Yeah, the blood loss is at 30 or at yeah, 30 for for arc 10 arcane. My blood loss is at 51 and I have 14 arcane. So literally 4 points out of that much <clears throat> for arcane, but it doesn't add any more scaling right now. So I'm mainly just going to focus more to health um at this point to be safe. I don't know why I went this way. I could try to kill him, but I don't feel like it. I do need to put on my wolves, though. So right now we're going to get later game areas. Uh, I'm going to skip past and go try to upgrade my Reduvia to plus two. If you're wondering where I'm going or what I'm doing, uh, this is there's like I have a guide on how to start, get started in PvP in this skip point, um, but I'm gonna do a full guide on like how to get set up for PvP on a build like this, um, how I did it, what I did, what I went for, and that sort of thing. Because all this is is a low level PvP build. You're gonna be fighting people that have less upgraded stuff because you're getting paired. It's kind of like doing below 50 PvP in Elder Scrolls, kind of. But not really. Because you're still doing the same content. you just done it before, but you did it at a lower level. That's the easiest way to describe it, honestly. I'm loving the game, man. 
a lot of fun. I think the PvP is where we're gonna get where where we're gonna have a lot a lot a lot of fun. And I think it's where that's what I want to cover on my channel. Um, I like the weapon guides and stuff, but they just they're they're easy to do, but they're not very engaging. It's just like it's not something I enjoy too much. And now, like teaching people how to use the weapon, that's a different story. But like doing a location guide, all that stuff, it's okay. It's very easy to do, and it's they've really helped, you know, this kind of transition process over. But um, they're not something I really want to cover all that much. Surprise, no matter why, don't go, don't get that lantern here up here. But we beat the game today and, you know, kind of decided I wanted to focus on a, making a PvP build. No, they don't accept you to invade. You just invade their world. <laughs> You're like, I'm coming in. Purified ruins. I don't know what this has in it. The only way that you you can invade somebody in the first place, anyways, is to have um, is to have whatever you call it. Um, co-op. They have to be in co-op. Be invaded. Good Emperor, how you doing, buddy? Check this thing out up here. Take me. Puts me to. Okay, let's get a grace location up here so we can teleport. I don't remember where one's at. So right now, all we're doing is getting set up for, for PvP. We are here. One over here this way. Got it. You're 241 Gs. You're not going to get any PvP out there, dude. I gotta get no PvP up there. I'm making a new character right now just so I can PvP. I'm level like 130 something, I think. Alright, so there's that grace location. Come back down. What's up, Cole? How you doing, buddy? Alright. Now there's that. This crystal tunnel up here. to this crystal tunnel. I think it's... So we're going to get somber upgrades, somber smithing stone upgrades for our Reduvia dagger so we can go back and kill some bosses. So yeah, once you get to a certain level, you're just going to spend all your money on upgrading weapons, on buying cookbooks and all that. Hey, babe. What's going on, Pink? How are you? How's work going? We're making a PvP build right now. So, get to see some PvP in a little bit, maybe. Maybe not today, but I'm going to try to get some PvP. I know you, I know that's your thing. You don't like to be 
killing bosses. Jeez, that guy just sniped me. Is the pole blade still bugged? I would say so. I know there's a few weapons that scale with arcane right now are bugged. Uh, 50 is what I'm looking at right now. 50 is my level cap. That's where I want to go. I'm the, I did... So I, I kind of messed up my beginning process when I first started. I focused on PvP at first, and I really should have focused on finding weapons, stuff that I liked. But... Um, but it actually kind of paid off in the end because I kind of know what pvp is going to be where like i'm going to mainly mainly be focusing on this this lake area to pvp at what's the best bleed weapon currently it's going to be it's going to be either the the blood katana or something be one of the best but if you guys don't know this you see this on the map right here anywhere this is a is this is going to be a a uh cave or some type of tunnel or some type of thing where you can find upgrades for your weapons so you look at the difference in it, it's like in, a, in the mountainside this is there's not always like this but a lot of them are there's a lot of cool weapons for mages what do you mean man there's a lot of cool weapons for mages How's work going, Pink? Is there a lot of exploiters? I'm not... Oh, what are they exploiting? Legit, what are they exploiting? Like, just grinding a spot or something? Or, or what? Let's see if I can kill one of these guys. If I can, I'm just going to focus on uh, at 10 damage. Get that. I'm going to go to with my, my dagger and quick step. Oops, wrong weapon. There's a smithing stone. Okay, babe. If you want to join the party, I can make a party if you want. If you're... Take a break or something. Anyways, hope you have a good, good work, babe. I love you. This is plus two upgrades, so we need to find plus ones. That's a lot of damage. I get. I need plus ones and plus twos to upgrade. Only got a plus two somber. Go back down there again. 
Does anybody know where somber ones are for, for the boss weapons? I don't remember where those are off the top of my head. Yeah, bro, you, whenever you're making a PvP build, you don't really worry about these guys. At all. You just skip past them. Uh, we'll be able to do that here in a second. Yeah, the meteorite staff. Nice has a video on that. That's the, the legit, the best weapon you can get early game for a, for a mage. A mage build. Like, no, no lie. Like, legit, the best weapon. Grab the freaking... I think stones, dummy. Jeez. Yeah, but there's only a very few. <laughs> God, it's courageous. These guys are freaking ruthless. Stay away from me. No. Yeah, we can buy some from him up there, I guess. But I'm just looking for them so I can grab them in the early game. Goodness gracious. Grab the chest! Grab it! No! The limb grave tunnels those only gave the smithing stones. I'm looking for the sombers. Look at the map. There we go. I know where we go now. I know where we go, fellas. I know where we go. Yeah, you're, you're gonna. This is this is gonna happen to you a lot whenever you're first starting, because <laughs> you're you're not supposed to be here, like level wise. Um, we're not supposed to be here. <clears throat> I don't want to go by the giant stones. There's a there's a a tunnel down here, right there. So, if you're ever making a build and kind of don't really know where to look or or what to do or whatever, then just look on the wiki. There's a there's called the Fex it's the Fextro wiki where it has like the interactive map where you can like look at stuff and it's a very good resource because like it'll show you kind of where things are at so it's not so difficult. For melee a great sword is the way to go. Check out check out my video on the Bloodhound money. The Bloodhound's fang weapon. Well, I got it right here in my inventory. This thing right here is the best early game weapon in my opinion. The best. I've used that game, I've used that weapon all the way from... Wait. Um, is it behind me? I've already been here. Hey. It should be there then, huh? It's, um, some cave. I forget, the t I forget what it's called. Right here. Could be. I missed it. I literally just didn't turn around. 
This is the Morn Tunnel is what it's, what it's called. This says there's on the on the wiki it says there's there's somber stones here. Oh, there's something up there. And also the reason why I like that weapon money is if you wanted to go with like a spell caster, or if you wanted to like upgrade your or buff your weapon with whatever. Um, like so for example. Zone. So like I I really enjoyed buffing my weapons with the blood flame. So I went with a uh, um I went with arcane scaling. It's kind of complicated to really describe, but not arcane scaling. Hold on. Um, but it was. It, yeah, it was arcane. I had to do ten points in arcane, twelve into faith. That's what I had to do to be able to use that. But there's other ones you can go like with a mage style, and you can go with um. You can go with uh like. Intelligence, and you can scale that up. I think this is doing any damage for it. What's it called? Look up, look up Elden Ring interactive map. If I think if that's what you're asking for, Elden Ring interactive map. For sombers, they're supposed. They said there were sombers on here, in this tunnel. I'm not finding any though. Get dirty little goblin and steal all their, steal all their stuff. <laughs> Room. I don't need that. Here's Sombers. Oh no. Freaking roll catching me all over the place, sir. What? Forget you, buddy. I'm not even gonna talk. I run away from you. You're literally expecting to die down here. You don't even try to kill too much of stuff. There's two sombers, so that should be good right there. You have a somber one and a somber two. It needs to be a somber stone because of the Verduvia weapon we're using. 
probably gonna die here, fellas. <laughs> oh no. No. All right, let's try this. Quick step, quick step, quick step, quick step, quick step, quick step, kill, quick step. <laughs> there we go. Whew. Oh, we gotta make it out. The Reduvia dagger needs the Sombers. This is a new Toon Madrox. So we got we got somber one and somber two. So this will actually we can get a reduvi up to plus three relatively early. Get yeah, the souls to upgrade it. That is. We can go down here and kill that guy. Too. Took you for no matter out so yeah, we got plenty. Strength and armaments, Reduvia. Yeah. Plus three. That'll be good for our for our killing potential. Um let's go get the next level up too, I guess, huh? What else can we get? Six out. What's good, Karma? How you doing, man? Level up. Okay. For the early game, it's gonna be, um, it's gonna be bleeds. Not a lot of people have enough resistances for bleeds. Recruit my name isn't this for round table. I never knew, although I'm still looking. All right, purpose lady right here. I can't remember very well. It is set. We're making a bleed builds for the early game. Well, not early, early game. We're going to get to level 50. But um, we're making a build strictly for well, PvP. I took you, ma'am, out to lay out your own. Oh, she's crazy. She has it. I saw in her eye. Well, no crime. My big desire, despite my desire to. With it, I'm still looking. I don't believe if I do, I suppose I should. I'll ask Mass certainly. I know he's I can tell. Let's go ahead and upgrade my wolves, too. Upgrade my wolves. If I do, I suppose I'll ask Master Hugh. Allow me, you, a house, remember your place. Guess we have to talk back to this guy. No, uh, end game. We're gonna use the rivers of blood katana. Well, I took you, my man, to lay out your own. But you would stay with an ugly brute. Absurd. I don't doubt. If I do, I suppose I should try. I'll ask Matt. If I do, I suppose I'll ask Matt. Um, you mean co-op invasions? No, I mean, I'm going to be the one invading. 
I'm gonna be the one doing PvP. Good. I have you to I can have I am as yet, but, but and if there's well I swear to God a recap. Full stuff gave my wolf. Okay. Alright, so let's go. So how, okay, my question is, how do we get, remember this, there's a little, there's a teleporter thing over here called the Bestial Sanctum. Do you guys remember how to get over here? Because I remember getting teleported over there. Cause there's um there's a there's a fort like legit right here i'm trying to get to maybe we can go across and around we can try that there's a fort over there with a it's called the scar seal um something the score seal or something like that it gives us attribute bonuses I'm trying to figure out how to get over there because i i haven't explored that far the ghost ship east of Stormhill. It's of Stormhill. Where's that? Oh, that third church. Okay. All right. Because all right, all right, all right. I, I got a death route already. I just didn't know how to kill that one. North, so it's, a, it's uh, this thing right here. If that's the case, then I can come from the Death Touch Catacombs, right? Just come down and through. Let's just do that. Okay, there's a port there. All right, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Ooh. Hello. Can you hear me? Help me. I'm stuck. The port's in the bushes. Oh, so it's just right here. Okay. I know you guys are a little bit behind, so. Oh, I remember this. Yes, I do. I remember this. I remember exploring this. That's big things. I remember teleport teleporting here the first day. Well, they're only delayed by 30 seconds because because that's how it's set up on the stream thing. Go. Nice, 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 nice. Thanks, fellas. If I get hit by anything, I'm dead over here, so.
Boy, I can't. Um, I, I, I've, I've tried to fix it, tried to adjust it, um, but it just seems like this does the best. I know it, it's a little bit delayed, but at least when it disconnects, it doesn't cause you guys to buffer too much sometimes. I even kill this thing before? <laughs> no, I can't. Oh man, these things are OP. No, we're not going for the sleeping dragon. We're going to the fort here to um get this scar seal thing. No, we're not killing the dragon. So the Taunter's Tongue, what it does is it makes it to where you can get yourself invaded by other people. So as a solo player, you can't get invaded, but as a... As a... Uh, dragon's huge, dude. But as a... um. When you have that Tantra's tongue on, you can get invaded. And we also we need that medallion too for a for a, for a quest. So we can actually go PvP. This is actually really good because oh, I just didn't even realize that. That medallion right there, it takes us to PvP as well without even having to killing that salamander boss. These rats are OP. This is the best in slot. So look at this. Look at my stats before and look at it after. I gain like 150 health. I take a little bit more damage, but this is the best in slot. Um... For PvP. I'm just gonna de aggro these guys. Well, I wouldn't even necessarily say PvP on off switch, it's more or less you're telling PvPers they can invade you. Yeah, it's the, this is the best in slot for PvP. Also, you get that medallion as well. That medallion that we got in our inventory unlocks a lift up here. Like there's a lift over here that unlocks from that medallion. There's one there. And I think there's actually one down here, if I'm not mistaken. Is that is this where the other medallion is? Is that where the other one is at? Yeah. Am I am I not mistaken? Is this where the other medallion is? 
But then once we can get this medallion, we can go all the way up here to this lift and completely bypass this boss, this boss, Ranala's boss, the weeping area. This down here is is that right? Is that where the other key, other part of the um other thing is the other yeah but there's a there's a lift that you can use that you can use that lift Fort Fort Heights where's that at no, let's castle Morn. Where's Fort Heights? That's it. Oh, yeah, there it is. It's here. So, yeah, yeah, it's Fort Height. So, once you... Yeah, 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 yeah. So, now... So, we got that. Okay, so we got this thing. We're going to unlock this here in a second as well. Well, we got that. Now we're going to go get this other medallion part. Getting this other medallion part will make us be able to where we can use that lift to go past the salamander boss. Once we get this medallion and go past the salamander boss, um, we we're basically can go to endgame pretty much. I don't remember where this thing's at. These things shouldn't be too hard easy either. It'd be too too hard. Yeah, they're not. This guy maybe though. Well, that's lovely. Um, let's turn out the aggro everything. Could oh, I, I think I know how to get that armor. Never mind, I know where we can go now. Yeah, we're gonna get the the Erd Tree's favor. We're gonna get the Erd Tree here in a little bit. We need to get two Stone Sword keys, and we can go to the Shrana Grave and get it. Uh, this is this is a uh, an absolute new game or a new character. Sorry. New, new character. Uh, it's called... It's the Scorn Seal, I do believe. Here's the other medallion, I do believe. Yep. This unlocks the Deka's Lift Medallion. Uh, but it's called... Redagan Sore Seal. Redagan Sore Seal. When I was level 50, I was getting a lot of invasions. I haven't I haven't done any invasions on my on my main main yet. So. so from here we go to where were we gonna go? We were gonna go to past around through and let's go get the armor. I wanna get some better armor. I'm gonna go get that skeleton armor. Once we get that skeleton armor, we'll go actually go back, backtrack, and go kill some bosses. But this is how you get prepared once you're like higher level and you kind of know what you're doing. So you don't have to even bother with like um, being so far behind, right? You can actually get some stuff done. Got better shield. And it doesn't take even that much time either just to do this. 
but we've been streaming for two hours and we've already over we've gotten on all this stuff unlocked this is a brand new character in two hours have i tried being a hunter no i have not what's this it's gonna unlock something that we don't have back down I don't want to XV1 nobody no I'm not an XV1 or There's a grace location here. There's one back there on the wall. There's not one over the side. We keep going. I think we're going the right way. Yeah, I've enjoyed it. I just wish the co-op was better. I think once Pink can kind of learn some stuff about the game, um, and she can kind of get past some of the bosses and stuff, I think it'll be, it'll be some fun. We can set up some tournaments or something. I think that could be cool. location right around here somewhere For that though there it is I think well the PVE and the reason why you enjoy the PVE in this game is because it's engaging it's, it's hard it's difficult it's it's the reason why us PvPers like these sort of games is because we don't get, you know, nobody holds our hand and tells us what to do, right? It's all, it's all, um, I think it's this way. It's all us. It's all on, like, on our shoulders. So right now what we're doing is we're getting another part of a medallion for a different lift in another area that we're going to go back and then we're going to go get invaded by another chick. Going to come and try to kind of take our medallion. There's a lot of things I've learned in this past week on this game that I literally just makes the game so easy now. Like, once you get all this information. Please, no. Dear me. I haven't a clue. No secrets lie with me, not a one. Oh, please, leave me be. Annoying. Or give me the medallion. Her. This guy is pathetic. Goodness gracious. My lord, you're freaking insanely strong. Yeah, I can do that too there, sir. Yeah, 
Yeah. Well, oh, I will finish. The curse may beg you. You must keep. And if you. I can make daily journey, but for deep. All right. Now you go back to the round table. No, we're good. We're doing good, man. We're fine. We're doing fine. I got some cool looking armor. Oh, we can also equip the katana too if we needed to. The reason why this is so powerful, especially for early game, is without this score seal, we can't equip this katana because it needs seven or eleven strength and fifteen dex. But with this. 11 strength, so we need two more strength and 15 dex. So we need two more points of each. With this sword seal, we go up and now we can wield the katana. Well, I took me my match. Which is powerful, right? I mean, like, that's insane. We got a katana plus five. What's the damage difference? 148 versus that does more damage. So yeah, I mean we could use this katana. So from here we shall go. Let's go get this. Let's go get this part. There's also some. get that oh my controller is starting to drift this analog starting to drift Notice when my controller is starting to drift on my left analog. I think it's because I use it so much. Just don't mind if I do, fellas. Just, uh, I'm just gonna grab that little thing there. This church should be. All right, so we need to go. Actually. Right there. 
We're gonna upgrade our flasks. That we can get through there. Possibly over here for hi. Is crafting a big thing in this game? Not really. Well, kind of, but not really. The only amount of crafting you'll do is um. Is like is like making some some stuff for your weapons and whatnot. Oh, there's a little whirlwind. Nice. What level am I? I just made this guy a little bit ago and I'm level 18. What's up, Zilla? Or, what's up, Gabriel? Oh, what's up, Zilla? I was reading. Love, dude. The only thing that's big about the crafting is just to. What you, lady? All right. Who's there? Well, it matters not. If you are wise, you will leave immediately. My flesh writhes with scarlet rot. It is a curse. Not to be meddled. If you are wise, my flesh. Here. Go grab. You need to find cookbooks in this game to be able to craft stuff. I wonder if we can jump over there. Oh. Oh. Not too far up, is it? Let's go. Did we make it down here? That's a pretty far drop. <laughs> oh no. Anything shorter? I guess if we get on the horse now, maybe jump to this wall. Fly down. There we go. Big brain blaze, guys. Scaling the walls. We can craft armor? I did not know that. Or you know. Wrong way. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Strange is even not the blood thing. Yeah, I think it's my favorite. I guess we can go ahead and do this while we're here. I mean, there's there's things that like I'm just doing now that I just know what to do so I don't have to even really think about it. I will say I've gotten rather proficient on the horse. I didn't like it at first, but uh, 
Um, I do like, I do like the horse. Oh, you were looking for an NPC? Yeah, no, it's on an NPC. You gotta fight these braziers. Oh, rip. Get back up. Specking into health at low level isn't isn't a bad idea. To be honest, specking into health is I, I, I'm not even gonna lie, dude. I think I have 60 health on my on my character with like max health scaling because of how much damage there is um, in this game. Sure, it's easy. The mechanics are easy, but you can get by with so much more mistakes if you just have health. It's blasphemous, I know, but, like, just do it and you're fine. There's that done, so we don't have to do that anymore. I've gotten proficient with the horse fault. Okay, so let's, um... Go with... New character we've gotten already a six, we've gotten eight flasks and a plus six. And actually, over here to Gale's Tunnel, you'll get some plus four upgrades for our Duvia and be done. What character is this one? This one is a bandit. We started off as a bandit. We're making a PvP build. Ah, uh, no, we gotta go. My controller starting to drag some. I ain't liking that too much. It'll mess me up in PvP. Sir, get away from me, sir. No, 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 no. Man's freaking jaws are on my neck. Right there. It has to be up here. This has plus four upgrades for somber stones. The 
concept of making a PvP build is to be most optimal as possible. This is it right here, I think. Er. There's a drift move there. The thing about making a PvP build is is just a PvP. Uh, like I'm gonna be invading. I'm gonna be the invader. So I'm gonna be against the co-op people. I think I have a freaking... Those guys are annoying. Alright, see you cool. Have a good night, dude. So, for the Reduvia, well, actually, I can't do... Let me change my controller. I can't do dual wield katanas because I started off as a bandit. Unless I got the blood katanas or something. And this one. Goodness gracious.
Dude, you're freaking dead, bro. Goodness gracious. That's annoying. <laughs> Heal before I kill him. That's all right. We got that Reduvia upgraded. We're just going to get back my souls. And he was dead. That's some bull. Can I stab you in the freaking eye? Screw that guy. I ain't gonna worry about him. I got a 100% block mitigation shield. We're just leaving this tunnel. I think we already got the upgrade we want. This thing's a freaking annoying. Right. Get my souls and get out. Explore a little bit more. What the frick? Jeez, these guys are zerging me down. Jarhead doing. Where did you this was supposed to be? What's going on here? Well, straight. I am. The... I was heading to Red where a festival is being. <laughs> it's time I set off to the festival. Doesn't the Good Nate. Oh, there was an entrance there. Ah, oh, so we could have gone over there very easily then. No? Oh, well, I guess you didn't have to go through all that trouble. Oh, well, there's that. So now we can go back to the side of Grace meeting area. Upgrade our Reduvia. Upgrade our character. 
And then we'll, I guess we'll go kill some bosses. I took you no man to lay out your own. We need six plus twos. That would do is getting as strong as it's going to get. to earn the strength if you're inclined to hunt more then i'll introduce you to garank i have a matter of and the beast him what say you i've marked the location it will lead you all right at the gale's tunnel upgraded that to plus four Now we can go to Spell Castle, really. Unless we want to go to the Deacus Lift. We want to go to the lift. Let's go to the lift. Get as far as we can. As far as we can. This is a new tune, yes. Get Look at that. Perfect pin mark. Guess we can make our way up towards this boss too. Get our location so we can travel back. Is Hero a good class? Hero's pretty good. Hero's decent. I would recommend for a new person, I would pick the um for the um for new person getting into it, I would pick the first class, the Vagabond. All the, all the beginning, well, the first class all the first character really does is just gets you started to be honest
all it really does is it gets you started. And we got that. I guess we can go from here. The green turtle, what does that do? The one I have right now is the Redrungan Sore Seal. I'm going to go back. Uh, do, how many? I have two. two three stone sword. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I think what I'll end up doing is... Um, We have to kill a boss to get more Alpen slots, but I'm going to go over there and get the Erd Tree one at the very, very beginning. Race location. Jump spot over here, I think. Hope there is. Yeah, we may we may use it early game. There's a jump spot over here. You want to get your health to 20. If you're trying to go for like a long term. Type of thing. 20. Locked in the runes. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's a tunnel. Where does it take us to? I need to get up here. How do we get up there? Are you talking about the ring or, or the talisman or are you talking about how to get up there?
Maybe we can get up through here, through here. Yeah, this looks like it. Maybe. Let me get up here to this lift. Shield. There's a church and this should have... Wow. Looky there, that couldn't have went any better than I could have ever imagined. Wasn't expecting to get a sacred tear there. Mind if I do? We got plus nine now. Plus eight. Plus seven. Oh, I can't even read. I'm terrible at English. It's left. Should be maybe it would help if I paid attention. Maybe a little bit, huh? pretty much use all the weapons in the game uh not use them all but i've i've seen them and kind of figured out what i like what's good mac We skipped. For 500 kills at Stormville Castle using dual river blood. Jeez, yeah, that sounds like a lot of fun, dude. I'm, that's what I'm going for. What we're going for. go back and kill a uh, few bosses to get some souls but other than that we're almost set gonna get upgrades 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 you have to get Margaret to to beat Margaret to get to What's SS3? Let's appear. SSS3. Wow. 
kind of fun to watch this speedrun character build. Yeah, it's, it's kind of fun to do uh, to an extent. Sacred Tears, Stormcaller's Church. There's a church here. Mm, no, you don't have to be... You don't have to beat Margaret to get that. Back it up now. Um, we need to get up to the top. I think we have to get over here to get up there. Seeing. I think we do. Get up there. Maybe. We'll see. You can get somber smithing stones from, from, from mines. Um. Yeah, for sure we could do some 1v1 tourneys. Just, just PvP in general, just get some fights and practice, because nobody's expert level god tier on, on this, right? I and mean, we're all still learning. Also trying to figure out some stuff. Everybody's still learning. No, I'm on I'm on PlayStation 5. Semi dual Ushi's Dex build at the moment for max bleed. How much arcane should I be aiming for for what's a good upgrade um on the Uchis? So it just depends on your level and what you're truly trying to go for. Um, my level, I'm going to go for the Blood Katana. I'm going to do that. I'm not going to go do wield, but I'm going to go... Um, um, I'm personally not going to go do wield, but it just depends. Um, what level are you at? Because there's like an optimal like upgrade too. This will take us around, won't it? It shall. Yes, it will. Take me all the way around. Drop me runes? Uh, I'm just trying to get to level 50. I don't really need too many. I mean, I, it's okay. It's no big deal. We also got the Knight Twin Swords too. If you if we wanted to use that, we need a little bit more strength. Sixty-seven ish. Um, I wouldn't go past plus six on boss weapons. If you're trying to PvP, that is. If you're trying to do do PVE and stuff. Right now, what I'm going for is I'm going for Rivers of Blood on a level 50. That's kind of what I'm shooting for, personally. Yeah, Power Sands is fun. It's just not something I... I don't know. I'd, I'll have to see if I like it. It's going to be a lot of testing on my part. Um, as well, because I'm still learning a lot of stuff. Well, it depends on the level. Oh, no, I don't want that. Whew. It depends on your level, because if you go, if you're like level, for example, 50, and you upgrade your weapons to plus five, you're not going to invade anybody 
that's going to have higher than your weapons. But if you are, for example, let's say 50 again, but you upgrade your weapons to plus 10 because you've speedrun all the way, all the way through and got plus 10 weapons, then you're only going to invade people that have plus 10 weapons, which is only going to be very few. And they're all going to be like God tier like you are, right? So you're only going to go against people with God tier weapons. If you upgrade your weapons to plus 10. This guy may smack us around, actually. We don't have to fight that guy. What well, level we are... We just made this guy a few hours ago. We're level 20. But we're mainly just speedrunning consumables and potions. Because what happens in PvP is, you know, your flasks, they go from... Your flasks go from, uh... You have, like, 12 flasks, right? They go down to 6 at that point. So, you can only have so many heals. Plus four for these for this character. Sacred tier. Good for me. We can actually hop down to the capital. We may not be able to go in. We can hop to the capital. Do we need to go up anywhere? Really? There is... We don't need anything over there. Let's go get this upgrade. Another golden seed down here. Well, anything procs bleed that has the bleed effect. Typically, the quicker you can hit it, but I've noticed it's hard to really say. It all depends on somebody's resistances, I think, as well. All depends on somebody's resistances, too. Yeah, if you have seven flash, you get three. You get cut in half. That's correct. The upgrade stays the same, so that's why it's important to focus on upgrades. See you, Plop. Have a good night, dude. Definitely the, the Rivers of Blood. I think that's my favorite. get over there we can I think we went around that way go back to run around get that upgrade what's good carbon no no crazy discussions tonight we're just chilling making a PvP build <clears throat> We've already gotten plus eight with nine flasks. 
I'm, I'm very content with our upgrade so far. We'll be able to have maxed out flasks, probably. Well, not today, maybe. But this will definitely help us for later on into the game. I think if we use this flask, we're going to get a guaranteed full heal, whatever health we're at. For a while, I would say. Uh, the Rivers of Blood default is actually a unique one. Um, I, it may be an Ash of War. I'm not. I'm not for certain. But it shoots out blood slashes. I don't know if if that's what's called bloody slash or what. But the the thing I use does not cost any health. I don't know if the bloody slash does. But the weapon art that that the rivers the rivers of blood katana has does not shoot out any um or doesn't doesn't take away any of my health away right What am I trying to get right now? I'm trying to get max upgrades for my flasks. Mainly. There's that. Done diddly div. Okay, so past that. Gotten all those, gotten those. We can go to the Carrier Manor over here. Actually, let's go towards that lady. Let's go start that quest line. We can get that recusive finger. Yeah, the rivers of blood katana. That's what we're going for. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna stream this whole thing. I'm gonna try to at least. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try to stream um, all this stuff actually, so you guys can see how it how it's done. It shouldn't be relatively too hard. You're just gonna basically the thing is is. Trying to get past all, all the stuff. Um, and just trying to... you Basically just building up a, a, a database in your brain. What you need and where you need to go. This is teaching me a lot of like kind of the route I need to take. So when I do my video, this will be like easy. Easy stuff pretty much. This is going to start me with a quest line to join Hello. a Hello. group of people. Hello. It's right. My mistress sent me off on an effort. I was a... Could I ask you that thug made off with a... Only if you've any... What a bless... A thug should please... Have so much fun with the turtle shell and graft grafton sword, fully charged heavy packs only. That's funny. The grafted sword? Oh yeah yeah yeah. I'm gonna try a different quest line. I'm gonna see if I can buy it from him. Buy the nipples from him. What are you looking at? Trying to start some of me? Show me, and I'll consider part. I'm not in love with him. You first. Mm, all right. Things no damn use. Your bloody idea, mate. Don't.
So I'm curious because I haven't gone over there, so I'm curious if she's going to be at the lift now since I've opened up the lift. The thug should be resting at least. Thank you kindly. Did I forget to announce? I am right. I seek you are very to study such strength. Please. Brave tarnished, most tarnished, or doomed. But you are no ordinary volcano manor. Oh, Alice Land of Lyurnia is connected to the Altus, but the lift has been defunct for an age. Instead, you must sit at the base of the valley, near the Grand Lift. It was excavated from both ends. I have faith in you. I do hope the seek the at the base of the. It was excavated from. Let's see if she's at the lift area. I'm curious. If she is, then that's gonna prove all my theories it's true. If she's not, then she's gonna have to be over there at that other area. Her here. She's up here up top. Anyways, he's like down. Oh, really? Top of the lift, exit fence to the left side. Just missed it? Oh, okay. I'll go back. That was curious because people keep saying that she's on the. She wasn't there when I did that other video. Is she up here? Or is she only over here at that ruin, at the ruin spot? Because people were commenting on that video saying, um, I didn't see her over here. There she, there it is. Back. Rip, there we go. Goodness gracious, I thought the stream was gonna drop there for a second. Back. Alright guys. Here takes me. Inside the fence. There she is. Ah, okay. I've been away. I knew you. I hereby take my hand. Give. I will pray. A warrior, perhaps. Will you do I X rise with us? And now you build the drawing room, but be sure.
I thought perhaps play, but no, that the before you consider. Hello again. Has a skull under lady. Yeah, yeah, I know. The armor's dope though, but I'm not gonna do it. I just wanted to join. Just so I can get this waypoint up here and get the recusive finger. That's all I was doing it for. But wow. But we didn't even have to fight a single boss. We haven't even fought a single boss yet. Not a single boss. We've gotten Reduvia plus four. We've gotten Uchikatana plus five. We've gotten the Royal Armor. We got the Redrung Score Seal. We've got nine Flask at a eight upgrade. I think maybe even higher than that now. Flasks. We got eight flask at plus eight, and we have ten total flasks right now. Already. Still grab that map icon. Let's see. Point is either you do the NPC what you be NPC quest and the assassination, or you don't do the assassination, keeping some NPCs alive, then don't get access to the three NPC personal quests. So if I don't kill them and then I do their quests and then I and then I kill them, is that fine? I can do that. Okay, I just still don't understand all the, all the stuff about all this, all that jazz. Raid. And go. Can go keep going through and around and down and go get this bird tree up here but i think there's a little remember how i got over there
remember. The best PvP class? It just depends on what build you're going for. Oh, this is where I went. Started down here. I think that's what. Yes. I think I started here, went across, up, around. Get over here. Let's find a grace location over here so we're not the wrong. So for my build though, Cretus, what I did is is I went to this calculator and figured out what what I needed and required to use my weapon. Um and then I'm now doing that and I'm 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 working my way towards the Rivers of Blood katana. And once I get that, then my build's pretty much complete. Other than <clears throat> increasing my flasks and getting up all upgraded stuff. Pretty much. This would be a fast way to get down here. I need, well, I don't need to go, I need to go that way. Hmm. Like a big cliff there. Or oh, maybe we go through this tunnel. What's that? Yes, that's what it is, probably. Atlas tunnel thing. So. We go. I was like, I went got down here through. Through. This way, I believe. No. I have not tried that, no. I have not. Where's the uh, ashes at? If you can give me an approximate location. on the other side. Actually, I think I know where. I just need to go where I'm... Um Right side of Cablewood, Night Bridge Mountain. Okay. Definitely check that out. Left. Yeah, this looks more like it. Yeah. I like to see. I think we have to kill that boss in here to get across. I think. We're gonna be making our way up towards here to this tunnel. I don't know if we're strong enough to pick up this boss in here, though. I need some sort of keys.
Oh, for sure. I'm not even necessarily going down here for the upgrades. I just need to get across to use this tunnel. Well, this is what they were designed for too, right? They're designed to get you upgraded material. Let's go ahead and upgrade my character so I don't lose these souls just in case. step on different weapons um yeah i think you can i just i haven't found the step thingy though Yeah, I don't think you can use it on the bigger weapons. They have to be a basic weapon, I do believe, to be able to use it. Fix it so. Jeez. Guys. Freaking blocks right now. Better? Nope. Back down again. Let's just give it a minute and see what it does. I'm gonna get a little bit tired, anyways. Hopefully, updates. Love one out. <clears throat> you, sir. Probably dead here. Even out here in a second. Oops. We'll do it again. Please, 
me through. Let me through. Need to get through, fellas. I'm gonna put on my other dagger for the quick step, I think. At least I didn't lose my souls. Yet. Hopefully we can kill him. Come here, wolves. So if I roll dodge. Oh. What the frick? I'm still getting hit by that stuff. Dodging, freaking. I didn't give me a tunnel. I need the tunnel. Tunnel. Come in here, sir. Come in here. Is there not a tunnel in here, or am I? I'm not seeing things. Rested. I already got the I already got the recusant finger already, so we don't have to even worry about that. We already got the the PVP finger. Without even killing us. Dude. Stream's dying. I think. Stream is doesn't want to put out any any information. All on his face. Oh well. Um, 
Maybe we should go here. Let's go. At least we show we can kill a boss at low level. I mean, we're not supposed to be up here at all. We're way too low a level. Juvi is good. Um, is it better to go with dagger shield or do dual wield daggers? It just depends, man. I like the counterattack against the dogs. That's really the only reason why I have this thing. The shield is 100% um, mitigation shield. Um, wait, this isn't where I wanted to be, is it? Oh, yeah, it is. I'm just a big dummy. This is where I could have went through here and, and undone this already. I didn't even have to kill that boss. I'll take it. this lady, I guess, too. This is so stupid, dude. She up there? There she is. There now. She's not even in the water.
enough. Where are we going now? We're going this way. We're going up, but around that. She be, I think. The shop put us down into. Puts us down into this area which we wanted to be in. Is there a way to choose who to invade? No. Invade random, random people. Finally got it. Got that one. one. Only ones we haven't gotten is Ellen Church, side of grace. All the um, upgrades, I do believe, that we can get. Right, let's go back to the beginning. Let's go kill Godric. All these guys over here. Oh, okay, yeah, I guess you could do that, yeah. But you can't, like, choose, choose. I'm, I was meaning, like, you can't... If you wanted to do 1v1s, you could do a password and, and do a dueling thingy. You can do that. We'll see how easy this guy is. How easy do you think he'll be? Are we in for a rude awakening or no? What do you guys think? We have how many of these do we have left? We have two stone short keys. Okay, we'll go back. Is this this is an actual player, is it? This is an NPC, correct? I'm gonna go get a get a Gatorade. I'll be right back.
NPC, okay. I don't take any damage. Alright, that was relatively easy. We can go up towards this castle. Oh yeah, heavy attacks are insane, dude. I it's tightly you breached. Your job. Just wait till wait till um wait till you get to Molina. Then you you won't say that. You need the ashes at that point.
I'm not even necessarily trying to even do anything crazy, just trying to get to PvP stuff. Um, I'm just trying to get it completed and get it done with, right? <laughs> I'm not really trying to, to try, try. Then we can. Um, there's a faster way we did this before. I don't even have to go over here. Yes, there was something up above, go around and down. We're gonna have to go on that side. Well, to be honest, staggering is so powerful. Jump attack staggers are like broken. Instead of heavy attacking, just jump attack, dude. Get the enhanced damage jump attacks, and you're golden, bro. Straight up golden. Like, I literally did jumping attacks forever. It's the most under underutilized thing. Um, I'm liking the new ESO patch. I'm pretty good, dude. Pretty good. I haven't even, I haven't even, it hasn't even launched yet. Still got, um, the sorcerer over here, I do recall. Church. I haven't even played ESO yet. I don't know if you're joking or not, zombie. <laughs> I haven't even played it in the new update. Not yet, at least. Ah, the pleasures I'm looking when I'm not hot-footing. But enough about this place. Not exactly a... I 
Yeah. You can see it then. Well, I'm tiny. But unlike you, I've seen neither. Still, I'm privy to a... Would you care to look? As a fellow... T oh, keen to learn another... Oh, it comes out uh, the 28th. It comes out actually next week on PC. Um, comes out the 28th for console. If I do recall correctly. Guy is tough on the round table. Well, that's definitely nice, huh? And And some stuff I haven't even explored in here that I'd like to check out. Go so easy now. <clears throat> so that brings me to the front of the courtyard. Over here. Let's see what this guy's got to offer. Thank you. What the frick? The guy's hitting me from in the wall, dude. to show you you should just focus on getting the lift so you ain't gonna do all this crap over again <laughs> don't be too bad this time
What's this? I did not see this before. Oh. I've been here before. It's rasty to go somewhere. Nobody likes you. Leave me alone. I thought I was going to a different area. That's interesting. That's why I thought I was coming out. Get my souls. I'm not going to worry about even trying to kill her. My souls and get out. Stop hitting me through a wall. Sorry, level you just need two more into health. And two more into health. Don't let me forget, guys. We only need two more points into health, and then we're gonna go all into arcane. Then Look at how much health this thing gives us, dude. That's a crazy amount of health. Seal is freaking busted. How much health it gives us, guys? It's freaking crazy. I guess like in game PvP will be sleep and rot. It could be. There's no telling. Probably a mix of bleed and what other jazz? Two. It's crazy how much of a difference like a weak mix in your overall like understanding of a game and whatnot what is today saturday yeah so we're literally a week from where we started and like already have like kind of the, the area mapped out in our brains Oh, 
even know if we need to go this way or not. We're going. Here's another upgrade. I'm glad I went this way. That one lift we did. Is. There's something that did that over there. Remember what it was. Oh well. What do we get those? Was there something like a called the shackle here? Oh, there was that lady. She's down here somewhere. I remember her now. I think you can summon her to help you too. Here somewhere. Oh. Where's that lady at? She's like a warrior class. In here? I think she's in here. Be proud. You well tarnished. I am the I'm here by the cow autumn. This grafting is tainted the very if you intend to, I ask you call up the winds room from certain far. Apologies, as fellow town down whatever. As fellow town down whatever road takes. Right. Oh, can we upgrade again? If we can upgrade again or close to it, then we may as well. We need two more levels. I 
much more do we need? Uh, about 1500. Just use. How is your health bar so big already? That was. We get the big. We get the big stuff, bro. <clears throat> we have been grinding pretty much. We've only put our points into health. All right, come here, wolves. Do your thing. Hopefully, we can kill this guy first try. Be nice, huh? Gnarly roll catcher. Easy. First try. <laughs> I mean, well, these guys are freaking hard. What happened? Oh, he got what I tell you though. He had. <laughs> now I can can I. I can can I. One more point into health, and the rest in arcane. Pretty much the rest. Shield cannon? I've not seen the shield cannon used yet. Check out this way. Nice in here.
you know if you can upgrade the mimic summons like the wolves yeah you can upgrade those that's what you're talking about But what are you what are you talking about, Captain? You're talking about the people uh, the the summons that came out? Yeah, I got the dagger here. I got this 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 knife. Oh the memic one? Yes, you can upgrade that one. Yes, you can. Right? Now where do we go? Yes, you can upgrade that one. So, oh, right. I can tell you what I know about you. You've seen that structure. That's the Academy of Only its doors after they declared they, the Academy cast. As you might have making entry to the And so I'm stuck here. When they cast the seal. One. Without one. And you'll never reach the urge. And if you find an extra glintstone. Once you've tied up all your loose ends. Would you consider. I know it. I'm a blunt. But still. You might. Without one. You, and you will never reach the urge tree gap. Well, sir, I've actually already reached the Erdtree capital without even that thing you're you're speaking. He's over here. Let's go get it. Do you guys know of the summons that I can use to help me with this boss? Is there one of those that you guys remember or know of? We'll try the Jubilee Daggers, if, if maybe. You get, as you're telling me to. The, uh, the moon lady. You know how, like, on, on the last two bosses, I've had, like, a summons that's helped me? Where's, where do you get the rot dog at? <clears throat>
you, sir. I'm mainly talking about, you know, like the lady that helped me? No, 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 no. I'm not talking about the summons you do. I'm talking about... I'm not talking about the, the wolves, the wolf ashes. I'm talking about the secret person in the area. Right? That... Do you, like, in that last, in Godric... And then even in the in the previous boss fight, there was um somebody that helps you. Some NPC. You know what I'm talking about now? It's a storyline NPC. Yeah, 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 those guys. So how do I, is there one, is there, a, is there one for this? Where do I get him at? Is it this, is it this uh, church over here? This thingy? Is it that beginning NPC guy? So I remember going over here to the to the to that church thing. I'm talking about this boss fight in this in this area is there a summons an npc summons that can help me in this fight the npc like you know how just in, in uh, for for example godric i had that the warrior chick lady or Margit. I had the sorcerer guy. Is there somebody like that for this boss particularly that you guys know of? Okay. I just didn't know. Does she help me with this boss? You know how they say, like, oh, summon me and I'll help you? Type of thing? That's what I'm talking about. Goodness gracious. Nobody that helps me in this fight, okay. I just didn't know if there's one because it just makes it easier. If so, yeah, I wish I could take that. I need that. I need one of those things actually. 
for for um one thing. I just didn't know if there was one or not. That's what I was asking. Look at all the arrows in my back. <laughs> out of me when it does that. Stream's dying again, I guess. Whatever it wants to do. Dumb stuff, dude. I'm, I'm out of your AOE. Sure. much damage. Yeah, bro, I'm telling you guys, you want to focus your health on the early game.
It's so powerful. Morning saves. What is what is that morning? Over, over fatso. Oh really, dude? You just snipe me as soon as I hit my push. Mr. T. Yeah, we're just setting up our, our character for PvP right now. Going through a few bosses and whatnot. I'm just gonna skip past these things. I don't care about what's in those scrolls. Come back later. All right, I guess this is the, uh, the wolfy wolf. My stream is just here. Fine for a little bit, then just dies down. Like, wants to just fall over, the stream just wants to die. <clears throat> there we go. Hopefully, it stays steady now. Okay, let's actually go. Let's actually upgrade this knife. Upgrade it to. What do you think? Should upgrade it to like plus. I'm curious. No more than plus four. I'm not gonna go past plus four. Those are the champ item well. I don't want it to scale too high. There's even plus four. Let's go buy some of these things. Goodness gracious. Hopefully we're good now. Oh, it's dying again. <laughs> Goodness. Have you pox? Yeah, apparently. You are, but you know not. I've been. Be what? thankful of it is all.
How do you stream? I'm on now. What am I aiming for? Like level wise, fifty. The map in it will lead you to. <clears throat> Okay, let's go get that uh, beginning charm. I just end the stream because it's not working. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Yeah, we'll just see what it does. I'm almost done. <clears throat> Stream bit rates going down an insane amount and it's just not staying consistent. Stream drops for like a second. just keeps on dropping for a second and then comes back to it's so inconsistent right now for no reason whatsoever no reason whatsoever the bit rate right now is 700 which is visibly low you guys are like play-doh I don't know why, because it never does this at night. <laughs> it can fix itself. Needs a whole study now. We'll see. Half. No, it's not you. It's me. The stream. Can you guys come over here? This can interesting. I'm gonna burn that boss. <laughs> it burned me. Souls really going down there for anyways. I'd like to get my souls back. And there aren't not even any that aren't even worth going back down there. Okay, got that. Now we can go. <clears throat>
can go. We can maybe go try to kill this boss. Also another seat over here, I do believe, as well. If you recall correctly. Sir. Also on the back here as well. See what this is. I don't remember what this is. Hmm. This guy. I welcome I am my opponent. Do you know how it came? What shattering it is here at the church of by the match. And so our church holds in view the monument, the earth tree of the capital. Oh, you are free. I would so if you find unless in which case Oh very well, let heresy all think. Oh very well, heresy all think. That was a nice little shortcut to get up here. You want to kill that turtle? Nah. You're valuable, dude. You're valuable.
Mm. Classroom, huh? Probably should. Eh, let's try it. <clears throat> right. Where did he flee, my ah, Is it that to become? Been. Okay. How do we open that thing? I'm curious. I don't I've never opened that thing even on my main account. Level up. Thirty-six. This is the river of blood katana feed. Dex. Twelve strength. Mm, I need to put some points into endurance. <clears throat> In. In decks. So we already got eighteen decks. 
already gonna have enough strength. So I guess we just pump the rest into stamina. Maybe mind. But if you understand. Yeah, that's why I res that's why I'm making a PvP character. No, I have not done that key yet. Um I have not done that. I've not done Ronnie's quest on yet. Right, I guess we can go try to get over here. Is there a jump point? You know this like little this area over here? I think we got over here through Yeah, we also need the stamina. Oh. No, it's it's back now. Oh, it's just irritating. It just keeps doing it. It's done it several times tonight. Do the blacksmith giant, okay. Just, it's just been doing that all night, really. It's been really irritating me. Blacksmith's way up here. Yeah. Um, but Nash, I'm glad you like the build, dude. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Nope, I got T-Mobile. T-Mobile Home Internet. It's it does fine for... In the mornings, or not in the mornings, at night supposedly. It does great in the uh, at night. It has been today. It's the first night it's been doing this. I'm just gonna get a few more things. Uh, I gotta want to be on um, Nephis's podcast today. 11, so I need to probably go to sleep. <laughs> I don't have that type issues. Any classes that I think won't be good in PvP? Um, well, it just depends on what build you're going for. Honestly, Mitch, I'm going for a bleed build, so I went with Bandit because of the Arcane. So there's a weapon I'm going to use later on. Basically, what you do is you find a weapon you like, and then you legit build around that weapon. You you adjust your build and and everything to that weapon. Well, I presume you. Oh, pardon. 
pardon me. I am e an old Kotzo here, I perhaps. Oh, when I'm absorbed in my few country, I am after Utopen. This territory once been long. When the Raya look after level car in my country, that is one less you. I of the enchanted whatever you do. I of the enchanted whatever you It's for going. What's the best PvP setup for stats? Well, that's all relative. <clears throat> um. So, for example, on a bleed build, well, on any build, I, if you're going to be PvPing under, like, like a so level 50, something like that, then you really need to spec about all of your points in the health. Like right now on my build, I have 35 points in the Vigor and I've literally put two points in any, anything out. Two or three points. I've just been focusing on, on leveling up my health because you really need a lot of health lower levels. And I've been focusing on getting my flask upgrades and stuff as well. That's why I'm level 30 something with plus eight healing on my flasks and and um, whatever you call it, 11 total flasks. I've okay, so on, on health pool wise, um, it's best 40 is the soft cap. So, what is a soft cap? So what, what what that means is is if if you put a point into health, um, this is actually one of the most broken weapons in the game, by the way. Early game too. Like if I really wanted to cheese some stuff, and I I may have to. I got this thing just in case. Um, that's this is the, one of the most OP weapons supposedly right now in the game. And I may have to cheese it. Use the or use that just to just to maybe get to where I want to be. You have forty hours and got a flask. That's just because I've I'm I have looked at the wiki. I have the uh, the map 
kind of beside me so I can see like where they're all located. But also I found a lot of them as well, so. All right. I get there. Maybe I oh, I gotta go around that way on the right side. You. If you use rebirth, you go back to your basic stats, but that doesn't necessarily mean your stats are optimized. My stats on this character are going to be optimized because I looked at a build editor and adjusted and see what my weapons needed. No, I think the soul meta level will be actually higher. I'm already level 125 and I've beat the game. Um, I think the soul level, soul level metal will be 150 or higher, to be honest. Maybe even maybe even 175. Because, like, it's so easy to get runes right now that people are, like, sitting there farming them for, like, days. And, like, are level 400 something. But so people are level 400 after a week. The soul metal level may be cap at, seven, at 720 or somebody said it was at level 720. Um, but I'm not 100%. I say the sold meta right now will be level 50. Rebirth only takes your stats back to your what your character started with. The only thing the rebirth does. Okay, so let's see here. Let's go. I guess we can go through the capital. <clears throat> yeah, the, the, the bosses give so many runes. It's so easy to level up and stay, stay high like that. Honestly. Rebirth does take you back to, to your basic level, what you were. Yeah, I'm level I'm leveling up to 50 and I'm gonna do PvP there. The only boss I'm scared about is this one. I'm gonna go get this guy. You have to have larval tiers to be able to change your your stats as well, and you get those from the dungeon areas. And on in the underground stuff, I don't know if I'll be able to kill this guy or not at this level. I had troubles with him on my main. What do you guys think? The, the larvals change your character's attributes. You gotta take it to the, the moon lady. I may go kill Radon before I get this guy, to be honest. Oh, this guy's tough.
see what we can do. He can bleed. He bled once. Oh, rip. I got him low. <sighs> Stream is freaking irritating. I think I want to just end it here, I think, guys, because it keeps on just acting like a freaking freak. But I'm going to keep grinding for a little bit and then probably actually hop off for the night, to be honest. Um, let's just see. We'll try it again, see what it does, because it just keeps on dropping. It just irritated me. It just went down to, like, 900 bit rate. Let's try this again. In them wolves. Now it's down to sixteen hundred. Yeah, I just don't have the spec for it. I can't I can't do that right now. Some bull. Some bull too.
I'm gonna use the um the blood katana. I was gonna kill this guy and then I what I want. Um I just don't have I got the sword, but I just don't have the scaling for it. I gotta get 24 intelligence and 24 faith. I'm not even close to that. Another 50 levels. Not 50, but joking a little bit. Let's um Let's try to kill him off our horse, I think. That's some dumb auto aim. Why is it locking onto a jackrabbit deer looking thing over here? Dodging again. Oh. Got this reliably earlier, and now I'm freaking just... get the skeletons at because I don't remember where I get those at. I don't remember where I get the skeletons. I think those would I would I would decently upgrade. I just don't know where to get those. Summon Water Village. Oh, that one. I got you. Where is that now? I think these skeletons will still get one shot though. We can get obliterated.
We'll see if we can upgrade them. Stream is... I think I may just end the stream, guys. This just keeps doing it. And I don't want to be focused on the stream and dropping. Because I'm trying to make it good quality stuff for you guys, but... The map indicate will lead you to correct. What? Alright, guys. Well, I'm just going to end the stream. And I'm going to keep grinding this a little bit. And see if we can kill him. Alright, guys. I thank you guys for stopping by. I really appreciate all the help. But that's pretty much it for me. Good night. Uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys next stream. Uh, we'll probably stream on Tuesday for sure. That's my typical day. But alright guys, have a good night.